Good afternoon. I am Mayor Loreen West, and it is great to see you out here. It's great to be together, and this is an amazing opportunity. We are opening the Canyon Country Farmers Market. Come on. I'd like to take a moment to recognize uh, some of our uh, fellow city council members, our local di dignitaries that who have come out to be in attendance for this memorable occasion. Uh, first off, uh, Council Member Marsha McLean. Yeah, and I know uh, Mayor Pro Tem Gibbs uh, probably here a little bit later. Council Member Bill Miranda and uh, Councilman Cameron Smythe. And on behalf of Congressman Mike Garcia, the amazing Tammy Stevens. Representing our own Senator Scott Wilk, Chris Huff. And uh, Assemblywoman Suzette Valadares, Hesse Ayala. <laughs> Representing Supervisor Catherine Barger, our hero, Natalie Vartanian. <laughs> From our Planning Commission, Dennis Ostrom. And from um, Parks and Recreation Community Service Commission, boy, that's a long one. Chair Sky, uh, Vice Chair Sky Ostrom, <laughs> Commissioner Diana Boone from Parks and Rec, and uh, Commissioner Henry Rodriguez. A very special person who means a lot to me, who worked with me for a lot of a lot of years on trails, former Commissioner and Chair Ruth Ann Levison. <laughs> Good to have you here, Ruth Ann. Uh, from the Hart District Board, I don't know if she's here yet, Linda Storley. And from the Sulphur Springs School Board, Shelley Weinstein. Uh, former Councilman and former Mayor Bob Keller. He's here somewhere. I want to thank all of you for being here. This is really a great day uh, in uh, in Canyon Country, and we're very excited to officially welcome the third farmer's market to our wonderful city. Yeah, third one. This is fresh food, healthy food, a way for us to enjoy nature at our table, and I can't think of anything that's more fitting coming out of an ep a pandemic than having healthy food. Uh, the Canyon Country's Farmer's Market is a new and vital resource uh, for the residents on this side of the valley. Oh heck, I'm coming over here for this. This is fun. Here at our amazing Canyon Country Community Center, residents, and residents can get fresh produce. They're um, going to have a convenient way to provide nutritious food for their families and just have fun coming out and shopping. All of our farmers are certified by the state of California and they only sell what they grow themselves. So you have a lot of confidence there. This is the freshest produce that you will be able to find. And most of the food sold here today was picked in the last day or so. So I can't wait to go over there. In addition to fresh fruits and vegetables, our Canyon Country Farmers Market also offers some prepackaged ready to eat foods. And we have a lot of artisan specialties. This new farmers market will not only serve as a place for residents and local farmers, but it also creates a new way for community members to shop local. And by shopping local, we are creating a new space to support small businesses, which adds to the thriving community that's here in Santa Cruz. What a better backdrop for this new farmers market than what else? The amazing Canning Country Community Center. Yeah. We, we know this is going to be a really popular spot on Wednesdays. So remember, it's Wednesday evening, 4 to 8. The kids can go play on the playground. Uh, there's sprawling fields. The parents can enjoy shopping for fresh food, a little respite, a brain break. Sounds good. We all need a brain break, right? Everybody say yes. Yes. And this market is going to be open, rain or shine. So don't worry. Wednesday, 4 to 8, Farmer's Market is here. On behalf of the City Council, I want to thank a very long time Santa Cruz resident, Larry McClement. He is the current manager of the Old Town New Hall Market and for bringing his expertise to this new location. We thank him. Yep, he deserves all the applause he can get. Thanks to his skills and know-how, we're excited to open this brand new farmer's market site here in Canyon Country. So I want to have him come up. Come on up, Larry McClement, and say a few words. Thank you very much. 
All right, thank you, Mayor West, and thank you, our members of our city council and everybody that uh, took the time and came out here today. Uh, you know, uh, this is uh, just a wonderful venue, just like you said, and I just could not be more pleased uh, to be here. What you see behind us today is a real, genuine, certified California farmer's market. Uh, all too often in our food chain, we're focusing on how cheap and efficient we can get our food, but sometimes we're forgetting about quality and freshness, and that's really what our California farmers markets uh, are all about. Uh, most of the produce, like our mayor said, was picked within the last 24 hours or so. We had one of our farmers from Lancaster uh, out picking this morning, and I saw a video of him live on Instagram picking fresh arugula for our market today. And, and you know, we're able to get produce in your hands that is uh, days old and not weeks or even months old because produce can be stored long term before we see it on supermarket shelves. So uh, the freshness means that what we have is more nutritious uh, and it's just the, one of the best things that you can get out there. So alongside our produce today, we offer amazing high quality prepared foods. I am proud to say that most of the prepared foods here today uh, are from our food artisans that are based right here in the city of Santa Clarita, yeah. which is always wonderful. Uh, Outside of the food, we also aim to be a place where uh, that's about community. We want to be a place where friends and families can get together, meet, have a nice relaxing evening. Uh, and we're always looking for how we can uh, kind of achieve that, uh, uh, that the community goal and better our community. Uh, we're proud to partner with Feed SCV, who's one of our local nonprofits who's here today. And always looking, yeah. <laughs> They are, they are always looking at how we can benefit uh, those in the community and help people get access to healthy, nutritionist, uh, nutritional and sustainable foods. So uh, our market today would not have happened had it not been for the vision and leadership of the city of Santa Clarita. Uh, our local farmers market, having them has been a priority for the city going back as far as I can remember. So uh, on behalf of our small farmers and food artisans, we thank you and thank our city council and, and everybody from our city who's been absolutely wonderful to work with. Um, just a real quick uh, thank you to everybody who has just been so, excuse me, amazing, helping pull today off. Uh, my wife and operations manager, Stephanie, right there. Uh, our assistant, uh, operations assistant, Wendy, who's right back there filming. Uh, our assistant manager from Newhall, my son, Brandon, who is around here and back somewhere. Uh, our new assistant manager of the Canyon Country Farmers Market, Carol Rock, who's around here. There she is back there. Um, and of course, our wonderful market assistants, my son, Michael, Mia, Zach, Nikki, Mickey, Julian, Cato, and Nico. We'll have a lot of people from our new hall market. Our whole staff is here helping out today. So thank you, everybody. Thank you, Mayor, for having us out. Wow, this is really a community and uh, family affair. And I just want to say, uh, what better thing, thank you, Larry, to talk about uh, the nutrition of food, Santa Clarita, what better place in the United States to live uh, where we have wonderful areas to get out in nature. And uh, there's going to be cooking classes here at the County Country Community Center. So, hey, get your veggies, learn to cook a new vegetable, get the kids involved, have fun with it and uh, enjoy because this is really special and this is a unique opportunity. This council and the city really wanted to bring unique opportunities uh, to this side of town and make it fun and beautiful and it is. So everybody join in. This is for you. So I'd like to welcome up uh, some dignitaries uh, representing Congressman Mike Garcia's office, Tammy Stevens, and she come up and have a, a word. Thank you, Madam Mayor. It's an honor to be here representing Congressman Garcia. We all know that there's no better place to purchase fruits and vegetables than from a farmer's market. You can get the best freshness, superior quality, and also speak to the farmers, which is really important. You know where your food's coming from, how it's being grown, and, and the best qu um, quality in that fruits and vegetables. And also, you can support lo local businesses, small-scale farmers, which reinvest into our economy. So, And we all know that there's nothing better than a homegrown tomato fresh out of the garden. So I'm super excited about shopping here. And with that, I have a certificate to present to you to the Canyon Country Farmers Market.
And our, our next uh, dignitary, uh, please come up, representing Senator Scott Wilk, who's been just wonderful with his community, Chris Huff. Thank you, Mayor. What a great day in Santa Clarita. Yes. Yay, Canyon Country gets a farmer's market. We're all excited. Yeah, I love it. Um, on behalf of Senator Wilk, he is so appreciative of this city council and the city of Santa Clarita because there is no city that does what this city does. They're always taking care of our needs, and this is one just perfect, beautiful example of what happens in Santa Clarita. We look for a need in the in uh, Canyon Country, and we fill it. We do this beautiful Canyon Country Community Center, and now we've got a farmer's market. So we're all going to be here every Wednesday afternoon. Yay! Um, everything Tammy said, ditto. Uh, it's great to have fresh food, but on behalf of State Senator Scott Wilk, I'd like to present a, a certificate just honoring this day and congratulations. So if Larry, oh, there you are, Larry. Larry and Madame Mayor. And rep representing uh, Supervisor, let's see, no, I missed one. Representing Assemblywoman, Assemblywoman Suzette Valadares, Patsy Ayala. I always think of Patsy as this wonderful bubble. She's always so cheerful. Thank you. And today it is a day to be cheerful. It smells good. We were talking, right? That it smells good. And I'm sure it's going to taste better. So today is the day to start trying fresh food close to our neighborhood in this side of Santa Clarita. And on behalf of our assemblywoman, welcome everybody to the Canyon Country Farmers Market. And today, of course, showing appreciation and best wishes for everybody that is involved. This is for the city. Congratulations. And Larry. <laughs> And on behalf of our supervisor, Natalie, come on up, representing Supervisor Barger, Natalie will speak. Natalie Bartain. Thank you, Mayor. It's an honor to be here today on behalf of Supervisor Barger. Um, she couldn't be here today, but she really, really wanted me to thank the City Council and everyone involved, and especially Larry. Thank you on behalf of the Supervisor. I know that it hasn't been easy, certainly during the pandemic, and I thank you for working with our office all throughout COVID and, and for bringing this to the wonderful east side of the Santa Clarita Valley. She's very grateful for all your efforts, and what a beautiful addition to this great focal point of our community. So with that, Mayor, I too have a certificate to present. Um, congratulations on the grand opening of your farmer's market. Thank you. Well, I want to thank all of you um, for joining today to officially open this. This is it's a red letter day. We're, we're very proud. This is a very, very complicated 
and very, very extensively researched community center. There's there was more infrastructure under the ground than on top of the ground. Uh, it, we're saving water. We're we're resolving the issues for Mint Canyon. We resolved the traffic at the intersection. It's a lot of work here, so I want to thank you. Um, we're now going to officially cut the ribbon. Two, one.